is round one. Marvin Hagler against Sugar Ray Seals. Hagler coming into the fight weighing 161 and a quarter pounds. A record, according to Ring Magazine, of 42, 2 and 1 with 35 knockouts. Ray Seals on the left of your screen, 44, 5 and 2 with 23 knockouts. He weighed in at 162. The fighters had agreed to a 162 minimum, and Seals is down. A right hook from Hagler was the one that guard him, and then a following left knocked him down. But it was that right hook that really hurt him, Gil. Yeah, that's what is known as getting caught cold. He really got nailed early. Hagler on the attack right above our microphones and Seals now will just try to get himself back together from that tough right hook from Marvin Hagler. Hagler scoring with a right and a left and Seals is down again. And that might be all for Sugar Ray Seals. He is wobbly and glassy eyed. Now he's saying to the referee that he's all right. Evidently, he's asked to continue. Hagler on oh, knocks him down with a left hook. It's and that'll be it. What a spectacular win for Marvin Hagler. Marvin Hagler, the three knockdown rule uh, should be in effect here. I think yes, that's it's three, isn't it, Gil? It's <laughs> all over. It is all over. A stunning first round knockout for Marvin Hagler. He wants a shot at the middleweight championship, thinks he deserves it. He has now defeated Seal twice after fighting a draw with him in another match, but this one was convincing. He won a decision. They fought a draw today. There was no doubt, Joe Clancy. There certainly wasn't. Well, you know, the last time they fought was four years ago, and Hagler certainly has come a long way in four years. His 36th knockout and 43 victories for Marvin Hagler over there, making sure Sugar Ray is all right. He scored with a tough right hook in the opening seconds of the first round and then just pounded him down twice more to win a first round knockout here and Hagler of course now looking for a chance at the winner between Hugo Coro and Vito Antifermo. He wants a chance at the middleweight championship. And we'll be back to talk to Marvin. See that right hook that you caught Sugar Ray with. We're going to roll it right now and you'll have a look at it, a chance to describe it for us. Did you expect you'd get him that quick? No, I didn't really expect it. I trained for a good, tough, hard fight. But like I was waiting. You can see me keeping my hands up nice and high and waiting for the right hand. That's what I was waiting for. Just a matter of just my speed, my timing was there, and I think that's what did the job. Coming up pretty quick. There it is. Now he was really done with that hurt. first right hand. They should have stopped it the first, the first time he was down. The man was hurt. The man's got a lot of heart. He's a good fighter. I wasn't gonna give him a chance to come back. I wanna keep him hurt. And it's just what I did. I went after him, so I ain't let him go. Referee Tommy Ross and asked him if he was all right. Evidently he said he was, but I don't think he really was ready to go. Watch the left. Beautiful, beautiful left. Right here. There it, it is. is, right there. Uppercut. I knew he was right hurt. Uppercut too. I knew he was hurt right there. And ain't no way he can come through that there. I had my speed, my power, my timing, everything was beautiful. I punished his body, I trained as though this was a world title match, and that's just the way it came off. Sugar Ray still game here, still wants to go, but really that left hook right there was enough to finish him. It was almost a looping overhand left because he was starting to go already. Well, all I thought about is getting him out of the way so I can get a chance at Mr. Hugo Coro. Bob Elvon has promised me a chance at Hugo Coro. Also, I'd like to say thanks to uh, Evan, Brooke Evans down at Provincetown Inn for... All right, the one that did it again, a very tough right hand. You consider one punch stronger than the other, your left or your right? They're both equally. That's the way I feel. They're both equally. If one can't get you, the other one will. Well, just another example of the kind of knockout action you're seeing each week here on the Sports Spectacular. Today it was Marvin Hagler on our featured fight of the week with a one-round knockout of Sugar Ray Seals. Tremendously exciting puncher Marvin Hagler who now wants to go for the world championship.